They added Siren to the game. They're now playable. Hello, Chocolate Milk. What's going on, dude? So this is actually maybe not even a new mod, I don't think. This mod came out like 2017 as far as I know. But that's also kind of the reason I wanted to try it. See, we've been playing a lot of mods that have been coming out recently. Uh, why don't I give love to an older mod? Not to mention, as far as I know, we got uh, like a repentance patch to better fit the character. Now what this character specifically does, as you saw earlier, I used Siren Song, my pal kit active, and I charmed every single enemy in the room. Not to mention, you can see I sometimes shoot a little pink one. That's also a charm tier. That's not just what they do though. You can see I have a weird luck stat for some reason. 1.08, what's up with that? And that's because... Every single time that you ooh, careful kill an enemy that is charmed, you actually get 0.01 luck. So it's kind of a little bit of a snowball effect. You know, you charm an enemy and then you kill it and you get more luck. And then the extra luck makes it so that you can charm more enemies, vice versa, along with that. Something also special happens when you use the charm tiers on a boss or specifically the Siren Song, and I'm gonna kinda try and get this done. You have to have the boss charmed and then use Siren Song, something special happens, let me get this. There we go, so Dingo's charmed, I'm gonna use Siren Song, and you can see a little timer shows up. And if I kill the boss between this timer before it ends, boom, like that, I get a little dude! I get a little familiar, he's just a, a dude, I don't know what this guy does. Who knows what this guy does, he's just going to the poop. Oh, he breaks open poop for me, that's what he does. Thanks, dude. He spawns flies! He's like, uh, he's a poop beggar, he literally, he, he takes poop and he gives me flies, sick. And every single time, I mean, you get a, a new familiar, so I got that poop familiar because I killed Dingle, right? Uh, who knows what happens if I use it on the downpour. I have an arcade here. Stats wise, uh, it looks like they- oh, that's a golden heart. I have pretty low speed, 0.8. Our tier rate is normal, 2.73. And our damage is a little under what it usually is. Typically base stat is 3.50. Use this pill, one makes you larger, not a big deal. In here, we got a monstro, and eh, nothing. Thanks, Poop Beggar, for giving me a bunch of flies. Oh! Okay, that's the run. I like it. I also like this Poop Beggar, dude. So I think we want to use Siren Song as much as we can in rooms with a ton of enemies. That way, we can get as many charms off as possible, therefore giving us as much luck as possible. We also got a secret room by complete luck here. Nice. You know what? Let's just do it now. I'm sure I'll kill Clog in time. I kind of have god damage because of Choco plus Cricket's head, dude. I can't see the timer, but I think I'm going to beat it. Cool. Is this just another poop bump? Oh, I just didn't get anything. Okay, that's fair. I mean, I, whatever. I didn't even want anything. Whatever. Yeah, I'm going to assume maybe I just didn't make the timer then. I feel like I took a little long. Open this. It's nothing. We can go in the shop, though, which sounds juicy to me. Uh, battery. You know what? I say this synergizes with the Siren Song. Perfect. And then I'll also go to the Curse Room. I think my strategy with specifically Choco Milk is I'm gonna spam small little tears as much as I can to try and get a charm off, and then when I do get a charm, I'll big hit them so that they die. Come over here, poop bum. We got a ton of poop to handle. Thanks for the flies, dude. There's a dime on the left. I don't even know why. Thanks. We'll go in here first because of the money. Uh, I'll take a coupon. Hmm. Yeah, early coupon I think would give me more value than early restock. I went in the shop also first, and uh, not the treasure room, just because it looks like maybe potentially treasure room is right next to a secret room, and I can get in there for free. Is my theory correct? I sure hope it is. Oh no. <laughs> it's okay, I, I can fix this. Could be here. Alright, never mind. That's alright. Not the end of the world for now. Let me destroy you. Hello, Turto. So many poop bosses today. We use Siren Song. And I guess I kill that guy first. Oh, I got a blood puppy! Look at him go! We even got perfection. And an angel room, which is rare. HP is what we needed. And relic or sworn protector. I'll take a sworn protector because this is the buddy run. And I'm thinking I just got to get all the buddies that I can, right? Let's take the Wi-Fi and go to the mirror dimension. I, I think I must have uh, barely missed the clog fight timer because I'm pretty sure I should have gotten a familiar. I got a random familiar from killing Turdo. I got Blood Puppy, that makes no sense. So I'm just assuming I must have messed it up. We can even get an extra one here because we have an extra boss fight technically. Now, I am playing really good. So our charm tiers are going crazy. We have so much more charm tiers than we probably should, which is perfect. It's not permanent though. At any point, I probably could just get hit. So while we can, let's try our best to maximize as much luck as we can. So that when I inevitably do lose my perfection, I don't lose that much luck. Same thing here, we'll charm. It splits off, let's kill this one first. If they're all dead, I got another blood puppy, double blood pup, how you doing? The blood pup Armageddon. 
is a fast approaching. You know, I think actually it might be hard coded what bosses give you what items. I mean, why else would I get two blood puppies from a turret, right? But honestly, like removing perfection from the equation, sitting at 1.47 luck, just three floors in without receiving a single luck up just by playing the character, that means the character is already strong. That's super cool. A really unique way to balance a character. And I like the fact that they're charm tier based because honestly, uh, charm tiers always felt kind of lackluster to me. It always felt like they needed something. Oh my god, the mine. I also picked up golden bomb somehow, somewhere. Uh, and I'll be real, there was no way I was guessing the secret room, so you bested me in that sense. Thanks, game. Boss moment. That's not worth it. Actually, it is, right? Because what if I uh, do this thing again? This song and dance. Wait, oh, I messed it up. Oh, no, I didn't. I got leeches. Why'd I get two? <laughs> cool. Okay. Okay, listen, if I get blood puppies from this, we know that it's just... Okay. All right. It's, it's coded per boss. I just got into like three blood puppies and for some reason two little leeches. So I think obviously here the god item is getting BFF. I, I just want it. Give me. <laughs> just give me BFF. I'll take it. Uh, I don't even want to go to the mines. I think it'll be more fun to go regular. My phone just went off as if I had picked up a dime. You know what? I'm gonna use Siren Song here. Sing a little bit. Uh, I guess that guy's just permanently charged, like he's not even an enemy anymore. Only this guy's an enemy for some reason. Got it, understood. All I needed was a couple boss kills with Siren Song and immediately I'm just kinda owning. A little bit of pwnage, some may say. The Metal Larry Jr. I could go for a magic mushroom here. No chance, but always try. Just kidding. Uh, and glitter bombs. Yeah, that's fine. Crane Ganium. No, nothing. I'll check the secret room. In fact, I'll blow you up. I'm confident enough. I don't really care about my charges too much. Yeah, here's the magic mushroom. Oh, that would have been sick. Uh, check my shop. Uh, dude broke open the poop. He gave me so many flies! I, I, you know what I should check out? I should see if Siren Song gives you a specific familiar for also... For, uh, sorry, a mini boss. Maybe there's like a mini boss familiar that you can get as well. Interesting. Don't need any of those. Okay, I think we can just walk in here and charm, hopefully, and then use Siren Song. I accidentally doubled up, but whatever. What do we get? Bumbo gives us... What, another blood puppy? I don't even know what happened. Oh, wait, Bumbo gives us Bumbo. <laughs> I mean, that makes sense, right? I'll take the two drops, and I the occult could be cool for us. Yeah, sure. Simple damage up, and I think we'll just go. I'm kind of vibing with the character, dude. So, for uh, general reference, I have been trying my best to maximize whoopsies, my luck. <laughs> I was about to say, oh, there's a crawl space. Um, it looks like, you know, four or five floors in, we're sitting at about two luck with no luck ups, just completely naturally. So that's about, you know, the a rate of luck that I would say you can expect. Uh, Crooked Penny is interesting. All of these are really good, actually. I can use coupon and do this. I have something to do today. In fact, there's a charge beggar right here. Maybe I could just grab all of these. There's a the blue map. I don't even care about the other ones, to be honest with you. I'll blow you up. I'll take blue map and go. I'm happy with that. Soul Heart achieved. More friends. <laughs> Why did I say it like that? My friends. Thanks for the friend, I appreciate it. I'll take the sense and we'll blow up the keeper and then we'll go. And then we'll go. Thanks for so hard. Shoutouts to Coupon for that black market play. That was kind of hype. Thanks for the eternal heart. And then a smelter, which could be more useful than Coupon at this point. Uh, just because I don't think we are really going to buy more things. So we'll take this. Do -do -do -do. Pills moment, sure. Verp. Verp, the one makes you larger. Eh. Could I verp something better, actually? Puberty, I found pills. Yikes. Uh, I'll just use Pristis right here and probably destroy whatever this boss is. Goodbye, gate. Can I get a charm off? There you go. Take our damage up. Check the devil, which we luckily got. I'd like a Krampus's head. I mean, a lump of coal. Thank you. See, sometimes you gotta check the game. You know how like the game always gives you the opposite of what you're wanting? If you say the opposite, then they give you what you want. Okay, we have a sacrifice room, which could be juicy. I'm not too sure yet. There are so many goddamn blood puppies. I found something that makes the character hard. It's the fact that so many bosses turn into blood puppy and blood puppy be hitting me, dude. Blood puppy is ravenous. Frame game this time? Hey, actually we did. 
I don't know if I'm gonna get any of this. In fact, it's been revealed that I won't. <laughs> All right, that's fair. I or whatever. You start in song here. Ah, look at that! I got a leech. It does actually matter for bosses that you just randomly find in rooms. What's with all the bombs, dude? Hello, what you doing? What are you trying to say? The amount of blood puppy hits. I swear to God, I, I've never been hit more by blood puppy, ever. And, and it's this run because I specifically just have seven billion of them always tracking me. Oh, he's, he's, he's ready! He's coming! See, there's always one! It's like every room... There's a blood puppy on the loose. Uh, confessional? Yeah, I'll use my red hearts. Super low chance for anything, but whatever. Get angel chance. I'm wondering if something special happens if you charm and kill mom with Siren Song? Like, what, what do you specifically get? There's no mom familiar as far as I know. Uh, I need it to be charmed though. Can I get a little bit of a charm going? Did that work? I, I don't know. I'm just gonna assume it doesn't work, actually. That seemed like that was not working. We'll go up. Was there anything juicy in here? Oh! Ricket's body, too. Unfortunately, I can't take that because C-section is right here. And you know what? One of the reasons why I wanted to do this, this is also really good because I have Lump of Coal Synergy, uh, is because I'm gonna be able to spam my Siren Song as much as I want. And I'm probably gonna get a lot of familiars by doing this. What is tough, though, is that I feel like I might kill things too fast and uh, make it near impossible for me to even charm them initially. So we gotta be on the lookout. The moment I see pink hearts, I press Q, you know what I'm saying? Well, it didn't happen there, did it? I, see, that guy was just not charmed. <laughs> he was not taken aback by my beauty. Seems like mostly everything just turns into primarily blood puppies, as far as I can tell. Looking for pink hearts, I'm looking, I'm looking, I don't see anything. I literally don't see anything. Oh, this is probably gonna be charmed. Okay, dirty charmed. Got the timer going. Perfect. Get anything? Nope, I must have done it wrong. What is that? Monster just became anime, dude. He was like squirting all over across the room. Looks like we have our last wave here. Just gonna double off on Siren Song just in case I didn't do it right. Looks like we got it. Okay, Bloodshot Eye. Hey, we got C-section, dude. Sick. We could fight the Lyrium right away, but I'm gonna hold off. Curse of Darkness. And this also just goes to show, again, as far as I know, uh, I don't remember picking up any luck ups and I'm kind of sitting at like 2.5 luck already. Which, you know, maybe in itself doesn't sound that impressive, but you have to keep in mind, that was for free. I didn't do anything, I just played the game. So you always have to consider that that, that right there is a value, okay? The blood puppies, they're on the loose. You know what's annoying? I, uh... I'm realizing the C-sections can't target Blood Puppy. In fact, actually, this guy can't target me. What's going on? All right, you know what? It's charmed. I accept it. Thank you. Do I get another poop bum? Oh, no, I don't. God, do I wish I picked up BBF somehow. Obviously, I was looking for it, but uh, unfortunately, I just was not lucky enough to find it. But BBF, dude, would make this so much crazier than it already is. For now, I'm not disappointed, though. I'll check here, super secret, and get a paper clip. Smelt it down. And then I got a track in the fight. Hey, he got his timer in right away. It uh, disappeared. No, it's, it's still there. Perfect. HP. Umbilical, I guess I can smelt this too. And then of these, I really don't care. So we're going down. When did I ever pick up a daddy long leg? Oh my lord, that's what Triacna gives you. That's actually sick. I like that. If you do the proper Siren Song play on Triacnid, you get Daddy Long Legs. That makes sense. I like that a lot. Loki turns into what looked to be a Blood Puppy just now, I think. Oh no, you know what? I definitely just gained a little Loki. That makes way more sense. Oh, so many unique interactions. I kind of want to see them all. Uh, let's pull up this beggar. Grab the 42%. We've actually been really good when it comes to deals, so I don't expect anything to show up here. That dude is large! He's so mad! <laughs> Looks like we have a hush fight coming up for us, which is exciting. I got an inner child. Yeah, okay. Thanks, man. So much money from those keepers. What was that? <laughs> so I'm assuming the way that it works is just it doesn't work with endgame bosses like hush and uh, it lives. So I don't think I can do anything here. I mean, I haven't even seen it lives get charmed. So I'm assuming that there's just no special interaction. But it, they are charmed. I did it! Uh, it didn't say I gained any familiars, and it didn't look like anything showed up, so I think I'm correct. Yeah, I don't think uh, It Lives does anything. That or it's Gertie Jr. who randomly showed up just now. Let's go! And here we have Alabaster, which dude, I'm gonna be real, I wanna take it. <laughs> I wanna take Alabaster. 
Smelter has easily done its job. So many trinkets showed up after I picked up Smelter. Look, look at that. What the heck? What? What are you doing here? Now I gotta go ahead and smelt mom's pearl. We'll take uh, the smelter with us for now. And then when I get an opportunity, I will smelt. And here we have Beelzebub. Nice. Okay, let's go fight Hush. Should be easy. Okay, I definitely charmed Blue Baby and then used Siren Song and no timer showed up. So I can probably hereby confirm that final bosses are not affected by the Siren Song interaction. I'm gonna try one more time. Uh, it does not look like a timer shut up. Okay, so we're just gonna kill Hush real quick. Mm. Holy moly! Stop! Longest Hush lasers moment. I hope I don't get hit one more time because that would actually be bad. I don't want to keep my eternal heart. Thank you. Perfect. Okay. So there you go. You can see it's a 2x2 two two room, so therefore I can smell Mom's Pearls. And then I'll take Alabaster Box with me, which could be scary because I need Soul Hearts, but well, whatever. I want items. Give me items. Yes. Is that a wild card? Huh. Well, guess who really wants to fill up their Alabaster Box now? <laughs> it's me. Now, again, I, I just, I don't see a way to. I don't know if it's going to be possible. But I just gotta keep in mind that I have some kind of wild card. There, there's a play to be made here. It doesn't have to go specifically to Alabaster Box. It's just something I should keep in mind. I'm gonna go ahead and full clear everything now that I have this information. Because now I'm a little determined to see how far I can push this. Hoping for like a Hierophant or something. Nice! Maybe plausible. Potentially. Highly unlikely. I feel like it's worth it to go in here just for the high chance of maybe finding a Soul Heart. I am unlucky. Holy vine boom, what happened here? <laughs> uh, but that's the last thing I expected. All right, I'm probably gonna die. Dude. I gotta stay on top of things. I wonder why some of them are charmed and they just can't hurt me. Maybe it has something to do with Siren Song. Maybe just using Siren Song makes it so they're pacified, which would be a really cool interaction. And that might also explain as to why there are just so many blood puppies that you get when you play this character well at least this time we actually have keys for the chest which is something i've been slacking on recently so i'm happy that's getting done let me check the mob challenge room maybe red chests yeah there's no way that's gonna have a soul heart it's just not worth it yeah i don't know if uh the alabaster box wild card giga play is uh in session currently however i might be able to find another god item in the chest therefore giving me the means to have a good wild card use or i could just not you know we'll find out just again triple giga confirming for myself isaac was definitely charmed there and i used siren song and nothing happened oh dude watch yourself man you're throwing mad bullet patterns in my direction here we go anything juicy angry fly hey i'm yelzebub nope nope okay exploding ipecac huh Exploding C-section, Ipecac. I'll take that on the way to the boss. I'll fight it with Blue Baby. But for now, I'd like to clear these rooms without Ipecac. You know what I'm realizing? These are mainly all bosses, right? So this is the perfect time. Okay, just kidding. You gave me the rare Hushy room. Uh, this is the perfect time for me to try my best to spam Siren Song one last time. Oh, yes. Thank you. Now that's going to make this really fun. Dude is so large. He's so large and in charge, look at him go! I think we were due for a blood puppy run, so I'm glad this happened actually. He's done for. The gate gives us... Could you guess it? It was a blood puppy. I actually don't know if it was a blood puppy, I can't see. Super secret? Uh, hearts. Maybe useful. What happens when the poop dude gets the red poops, excuse me? It says you're giving me something. Are you actually giving... Your... I found the infinite fly farm. Huh. I found the infinite fly farm. Look what happened to my flies. <laughs> Sick. All right. Well, there's a little synergy if you find that super secret room. Golden razor blade. Kind of useless. Ooh. Oh my god. I am stunned at the events that have transpired. I'll take the whiz. Excuse me? You gave me a wild card? <laughs> All right. Listen. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the best of both worlds here because I know people want me to Arky and I know some people are like ah we've seen the run I know what it's guy I like the character. Here's what I'm gonna do. Check this shit out. Here's my big brain play right. 
Let me go grab Ipecac, because I thought I was going to do that, and for once I'm not going to forget. Yoink the Ipecac. You're going to explode quite literally due to my exploding fetuses. Sing in front of your face, what are you going to do? Done. Now, check this out. R key, wild card, and, and, then, uh, and then I end the video! <laughs>